MG. Welcome back to my channel. So, so excited that you are here. Thank you so much for clicking on the video. I appreciate you. It's Jody Dunn, and I'm coming at you with not a very big, but an awesome Walgreens haul. Super duper excited to share this with you. If you are new and you just found the channel, I'm so happy you are here. Would you please say hello to me and let me know that you are new right down there. I would love to welcome you and say hello back to you. And if you are already subscribed, thank you so much for coming back to another video. I appreciate you. Let me know if you're all finished with your Walgreens shopping this week. Uh, today is a very special day. Today is the day that I became a mother. It's Grayson's birthday today. Happy birthday to my oldest beautiful daughter. I'll pop an adorable picture of her and EJ. Uh, she took him up north this weekend, which if you're not from Michigan, you don't understand the up north reference. If you're from Michigan, you totally get it. EJ had his first up north experience. So here's my beautiful oldest daughter, Grace, and I know you guys don't get to see her as often as you see Donna and Viv. Today is her birthday, and her wonderful fiance is taking her out today like all day long to do something. I don't even know what, it's like a surprise. So guess who gets to watch EJ? Grandma and Aunt Viv and Aunt Donna. <laughs> So Walgreens is super easy for me and it's super close to home. So I wanted to go ahead and take care of Walgreens today. I had an account that had a spend booster on it and I wanted to do, I wanted to finish out my fetch reward, my second fetch rewards bonus on my husband's account. So we are going to head into the Walgreens, do an awesome transaction. Of course, we will debrief at the kitchen table. If you enjoyed the video, make sure you give it a thumbs up. I appreciate you so much. Let's go grab some awesome deals. All right, we are in the Walgreens and I am working with a spend 25, earn $3 in Walgreens cash digital booster. And you know, I tested the toothbrushes on Sunday to see if they were double dipping and they were not. But last week, these toothpastes were dipping and I looked online and it said my store had stock. And my store literally has one. OMG. Uh, I really wanted to do this double dip deal. If you can find them, the Crest Pro Health Advanced. It has to say advanced and it is only the ones that are $3. I believe there are three different varieties. Uh, extra whitening, a deep clean maybe, and a gum restore, something like that. Don't grab the $4 ones. Those are not double dipping. So the $3 ones are on the weekly promotion of buy two, earn back a $4 in Walgreens cash. And they are also double dipping with the spend 10 in particular products, earn back a $5 register reward. So you'd buy four, that would total you $12. You could use the $5 off three digital coupon Walgreens just gave us and the $1 off one if you have it. You'd pay $6.00. You'd earn back $8 in Walgreens cash, $4 for every two that you buy, and a $5 register reward because you spent more than $10. And yes, you can always use Walgreens cash on a buy deal or a deal giving back a register reward. Now make sure your store's Catalina machine is actually working. If you do not get the register reward, there's nothing you can do because it's a glitch. You're not technically supposed to get the register reward. So it would make these a $7 money maker if your store has stock. All right, we're gonna start our fetch rewards bonus. I wanted to grab some doves. Somehow I missed on Sunday that they were actually buy one, get one half price. I really wanted two different kinds that my store does not have. I am literally striking out here. Oh Lord. All right, I need to regroup and rethink what I want to do. All right, I'm gonna do a small little transaction to activate a certain reward that I have. I wasn't sure if I was gonna use it, but I think I am. So I'm gonna go ahead and grab two packages of the Scott paper towel because I have a fetch rewards bonus that if you buy one toilet paper and two paper towels, you earn back a thousand points, which is a dollar, and I've already purchased the toilet paper. So I'm gonna grab these two, they're priced at $5, but I'm gonna have the cashier scan this $1.25 IVC coupon, so that'll bring them down to $3.75 each. 
So this account has the birthday month, but I never received the digital birthday booster. The Catalina machine printed me this instead, which is a paper booster, where if you have them scan it, it will activate the 10% back in extra Walgreens cash for the entire month. So I'm gonna use a $5 register reward that's expiring um, to go ahead and lower my out of pocket. And just like any paper spend booster that you get from the Catalina machine, you cannot use Walgreens cash to pay and still earn the Walgreens cash back unless you're doing contactless payment. So I wasn't sure if I wanted to use this paper spend booster because what's gonna happen now is it's gonna stay on the account for the whole month and anytime I wanna use Walgreens cash to pay, at least that's what happened to me last year. So I'm gonna test it this year and see if it's the same thing, which I'm sure it is. Uh, anytime I wanna use Walgreens cash to pay for anything, it's going to pop an alert up on the cashier screen that says, Customer cannot use um, Walgreens cash because they have a coupon. There is a way to override it, but I have to explain it every single time to every cashier because they don't understand it. So I wasn't sure if I wanted to mess with it, but I'm going to go ahead and do it. All right, I got that transaction taken care of and I have regrouped. So here's what we're going to do for my spend 25 earn back $3 in Walgreens cash. Since I can't get the double dip toothpaste, I'm gonna go ahead and get the double dip deodorant. Now, this is not a glitch. This is a legitimate double dip. I actually told you about this last Sunday in my Walgreens haul. The Gillette solid deodorants are on a Catalina promotion, giving back a register reward. And they are also on a Walgreens promotion this week of buy two, earn back $4 in Walgreens cash. So I'm going to actually grab three of them. They are on sale, two for 11, which means all three will bring up for $5.50 each. Now we did receive a coupon in our PNG. Here it is. This coupon is not working for anybody and I'm going to tell you why. Look at the first numbers of the barcode. They start with 0037. Look at the first numbers of the barcode of this deodorant. It's pretty safe to say when the first numbers of the barcode do not match, the coupon will not work. But Walgreens gave us a digital version of this coupon for uh, $5 off when you purchase three. So I'm gonna go ahead and use the digital version instead. And I will be grabbing one more product that is on that same promotion so that I actually earn back $8 in Walgreens cash not just $4 in Walgreens cash. So I searched through some of the Old Spice products to see if this coupon would actually work on any of them. Remember, we're looking for the ones that start with the 003700. The only ones I found were these sprays, which are not on promotion. Those have a matching barcode at the beginning, so most likely the paper coupon would work on those. Let me check this one and see. Nope, this one's on promotion, but this one has a different barcode as well, so it won't work on that, and none of the stick deodorants have that barcode either. So back to my Gillette deodorant. I'm gonna go ahead and purchase these three. Thank you so much. I had several of you send me the picture of the advertisement that printed out of the Catalina machine this week, or last week. I'm gonna pop it up on the screen. This picture actually comes from Diane, so thank you, Diane, and thank you to all of you that sent me this picture. And basically it's letting us know that the Gillette deodorant is gonna be on a register reward promotion. If you purchase one, you receive back $2, a $2 register reward. If you purchase two or more, you will receive back a $4 register reward. And that promotion runs through 828, but it is a good week to do it this week since it is double dipping with Walgreens cash. All right, I'm going to go for the Dove, even though they don't have the two kinds that I really wanted. Um, because they are on sale two for 13, which means they're $6.50 each, but they are ringing up at buy one, get one half priced. So two of them is going to total $9.75. And these are on the same promotion of buy two participating products and you earn back $4 in Walgreens cash. 
So these are gonna total me $9.75 at the buy one, get one half price sale. And that buy one, get one half price goes through the end of the month. I have a $3 off two digital coupon that I'm gonna use. So I'll pay $6.75, I'll earn back $4 in Walgreens cash for those two Dove, and it will complete my second fetch rewards bonus because I only needed to spend like $4 more and I'll earn another $10 back from fetch. All right, so here's what I'm gonna do to grab that fourth product to go with my Gillette deodorant is I'm just gonna grab a dang bottle of toothpaste that's on the same promotion since I can't get the double dip toothpaste um, of buy two, earn back four. So I'm gonna grab this $3 Crest toothpaste and I have a $1 digital coupon. So now here in my basket, I have six products included in the buy two, earn back four. So I'll earn back $12 in Walgreens cash for purchasing all of these. All right, we're gonna add a few Ibotta rebates and I wanna get my total up to $35 to be able to use a paper spend booster along with my digital spend booster. So I'm gonna scan some of these Airheads because we have an Ibotta rebate and a Shopkick rebate on the Airheads. All right, so these ones right here that are priced at $2.29 are the ones that qualify for the Shopkick rebate and the Ibotta rebate. So between scan kicks in the store and purchase kicks, I'll get back $1.26 from Shopkick, and then I'll submit my receipt to Ibotta for 75 cents back. So it would make my cost just 28 cents for these airheads, but they're all just gonna be for free because I'm working with my spend boosters. All right, next I bought a rebate we're gonna grab is on the extra gum. It's on sale this week for $1.99, or no, not $1.99, 99 cents. So I'm gonna go ahead and grab two packages of this and I'm gonna submit to Ibotta. We have rebates for 50 cents back on each one. And then I just need like $1.50 more to get me up to my $35 spend requirement. And then I noticed these. Oh, I love the turtles. So the big king size ones are two for $4. So I'm gonna go ahead and grab these for $4. And I have an Ibotta rebate for $1.69 back when I purchased two. So I went ahead and put back one of my extra gums. So now for all these products, my total is $36.53. So I'm gonna go ahead and use this paper spend booster of spend 35, earn back $8 in Walgreens cash. And remember, we can never use Walgreens cash when we are using a paper spend booster, unless you're doing contactless payment, which I will not be with this one. And I'm gonna use this $5 register reward to attach hopefully to one of my candies to help lower my out of pocket. And if you caught my Sunday Walgreens haul, you know I got a free $10 gift card and gift cards count as cash paid. So I will definitely be using that to lower my out of pocket. And then I'm gonna pay my remaining balance with one of my $15 Activate Reward Visa cards that I got when we did the Listerine deal at the beginning of May. All right, this is gonna complete my Walgreens haul for today. This transaction is a serious, huge money maker. Even without my free $10 gift card, it's gonna be a huge money maker, but that $10 gift card helped a ton. Let's get to the kitchen table and go over these numbers. All right, we are back at the kitchen table with this Walgreens haul. And I totally forgot when I was in the store to look for this. But thank you always to my friend MT. She sent me a message and um, Lorena or Lorena, Lorena, I think, um, posted a video. Definitely go check her channel out. I'll pop it up on the screen. She found some awesome Huggies clearance diapers and I forgot to look today. So go check her video out. I believe she shows the barcodes, but I'll pop the pictures up on the screen as well. If you are looking for any diapers, I think they were like really reduced in price. All right, so first transaction I did was just the paper towel. And again, I just wanted to activate that birthday reward. And the system will only take one paper spend booster per transaction. So I would not have been able to use the birthday reward and my regular paper spend booster. So I just wanted to activate that on the account. So that's what I did. And I totally almost forgot, but there is the um, 
two paper towels for $10, had the cashier scan the IVC, and then he scanned that birthday booster, which just shows up as a point coupon for a $1 or more purchase. And then there's my register reward I used. I almost used $3 in Walgreens cash to pay for this because with tax, my total was $3.10. And then I was like, no, Jody, you can't use Walgreens cash. So I just paid that using my PayPal debit card. And what I earned back for this was 70 cents in Walgreens cash because you earn 10% in Walgreens cash for everything you spend. Spend means any manufacturer coupons, or cash and I spent $7.50 so I earned 70 cents and then I submitted my receipt to Fetch Rewards. I thought I only had a thousand um, point bonus but I actually had two bonuses so I earned back two thousand points which is two dollars from Fetch Rewards. If you're not using Fetch it is definitely the easiest rebate app to use. I have a tutorial linked down in the description box and my referral code will be listed there if you would like to sign up. But the tutorial walks you through exactly how to use it. Now in full transparency, sometimes I forget to tell people this. Um, when you're new to the rebate apps, you will not have this fetch bonus most likely. You have to use the rebate apps for a little while before bonuses start popping up. But you will earn, if you sign up using my referral code, you will earn 2,000 points just for using my referral code. So that'll give you $2 and then you'll start using Fetch. It's just absolutely the easiest rebate app to use. All right, so then I did my other transaction where I wanted to use my spend 25 or three dollars in Walgreens cash and stack that with the paper spend booster that I got, so excited. So I grabbed the Dove at buy one, get one half price. So since they're on sale two for 13 this week, one rings up for $6.50 and the other rings up at half price at $3.25. Then there are all of my Gillette deodorants. The cashier just scanned all three of one barcode, even though I purchased two different scents. It's fine. Um, she did scan them all separately for me because she knows me. There's my $3 Crest, my 99 cent gum, my Airheads and the two turtles. So I had her scan the points booster for spend 35, earned back $8 in Walgreens cash. This was all digital other than I used one manufacturer register reward. So there's my $5 off three digital coupon on the Gillette, my $3 off two on the Dove, and my $1 off one on the Crest. And then there's my $5 register reward. So my subtotal was $22.53. I used that $10 gift card that I had earned on Sunday for totally free. So my total that I had to pay was $12.53, which I used that Activate Rewards Visa card to pay. All right, here's what I earned back. $26.60 of Walgreens cash back. I earned back four because I purchased the two Dove. I earned back four because I purchased one Crest and one Gillette and four because I purchased the other two Gillette. So $12 back from all of the products that are included in the buy two earned back four. I earned back $8 in Walgreens cash for my paper spend booster, $3 in Walgreens cash for my digital spend booster. And then I got an extra $3 for that birthday booster that will stay on the account all month long. So $26 in Walgreens cash is awesome. And then the Catalina machine gave me a 20% off coupon and my $4 register reward. Thank you from Gillette because I purchased two or more Gillette deodorants on that Catalina promotion. Then... I submitted my receipt to Fetch Rewards to finish out my Fetch Rewards bonus because I only needed like four more dollars to earn back the additional $10. Then from Shopkick, $1.26 coming back for the Airhead Ropes. Ibotta, I submitted for 50 cents back on the extra gum and a $1.69 or 64 back on the turtles. So $2.94 coming back from Ibotta. So let's talk about the cost of this transaction. So my cost 
was $12.53 because I used my free $10 that I never counted as a reward earned. So I'm not counting it as a reward spent. So $12.53 plus my $5 register reward makes my cost $17.53 for this transaction. And I earned back $44.80, 2660 Walgreens cash, a $4 register reward, $1.26 from Shopkick, $2.94 from Ibotta, and $10 from Fetch Rewards. So $44.80 earned. It makes my transaction free, plus a dang $27.27 moneymaker. Oh my gosh. Now for my paper towel, obviously that was a cost of $7.50. I earned back $7 in Walgreens, or not $7, 70 cents in Walgreens cash and $2 from Fetch Rewards. So it makes my cost for the two paper towel $4.80. So everything you see here on this table was free plus a $22.47 money maker. If you don't wanna count the $10 gift card, it was still a $12, but I'm counting it because that was totally free money that I got. So there you go. Awesome, awesome transaction over at Walgreens. We have amazing deals this week. I hope you do that Fetch Rewards bonus. Remember that will not show up on your discovery page until you scan your first receipt with Unilever products on it. All right, I'm off to go spend the day with my EJ. I hope you have an awesome day. If you enjoyed the video, make sure you give it a thumbs up. I appreciate you so much and I'm gonna see you again soon.